Welcome. Now enjoy Tuesday, Thursday, and Sunday. Fashion and beauty chic new releases. I'm talking travel, art and tech, creative business process, and love and light. I'm Trinita Blue, a global brand strategist, but so much more. So go ahead and subscribe and let's connect. Remember, as we climb, we lift others. Hey loves, what's up, what's up? It's Sheena Blue and today I'm here because we are going to be converting my straight, well somewhat straight natural hair back to curly. Using everyday products that you have at home, like an avocado and an egg. Let's get into it. Hey guys, so today we'll be using a blender. Okay. Boom, go ahead and plug that baby up. Yeah. Grapeseed oil. We'll be using extra virgin olive oil. We'll be using an avocado, one that is pretty ripe. You should be able to squeeze it because you don't want a hard avocado because that is what gives you clumps in your hair. Of course, an egg because we definitely need some protein after being straightened for so long. I went to my salon. I'm gonna have one girl who straightens my hair. She straightened it last time. I'll drop that video somewhere around here. Also, um, I'm up, and I also uploaded a new video showing how she updated my hair a year later. So this is what my hair look, is looking like right now. I did get my ends trimmed, I got my hair straightened, and this was about a month ago. So let's go over to the kitchen and show you how I mix these guys up. All right, babe, so let's get started. What we're gonna do, we're gonna go ahead and crank open this avocado because, well, let's get in there, yeah. Blender, and I, yes, I am using the whole avocado, guys. The whole go in with our egg, just go ahead, crack our egg in there, a little bit of water to give it some good consistency. I'm going to add in some banana for potassium. Not oils yet because I don't want it to be too difficult to wash out in my pan. Okay, so put the top on and we just blend it. Do add in my grapeseed oil. And you can just kind of eyeball it. Um, I'm sure mask at the same time. To kind of do like two birds and one stone. Yes, olive oil. This is what your hair mask should look like. Our hair mask ready to go. We're gonna actually change our clothes because things might get a little messy. Okay, so if you ever got a perm before, you know that it's better to do your perm in four sections. So we're gonna treat this hair mask like we're doing a perm. Remember, we need to get those roots. And then lastly, we need to get those ends, okay? And remember, everything needs to be coated. Treat it like it's a perm, I don't know. Does that make sense? I hope you understand. Tangle it with my fingers a little bit. It's already started to convert back to this beautiful curly texture. Like a perm, like a perm. As we do our edges, let me bring my dead dead closer to me. Taking some, and I'm just going to start it right here, putting it on my roots. And your hair doesn't have to be wet. If it is wet, that's okay. But no, it doesn't have to be wet. I'm coming from a flat iron hairstyle, braids or whatever. Oh, and also if you um, are taking out box braids, I have a lot of videos. I have a box braids video where I show you how to properly detangle your hair after you have your box braids in for a while. Just be sure to check them out. And I'm really doing a lot more natural styles because your girl is natural. I just never told anybody I was making all my bomb hair wig videos. So incorporating more. So I'm going to start with this section here. I'm going to take it. I'm going to start at the root and I'm just going to work my way down. Very important that you get that in. Don't neglect the end. And I'm just running this through my hair. 
And as I'm doing this, I'm detangling it. I haven't had my hair straightened in a year, so I'm praying that my curls come back to life, y'all, cause, oh, please come back. Please come back to me. Please come back to me. No, seriously, where are my curls at? All right, I'm not gonna stress yet. I'm not gonna cry yet, but I am kind of concerned. Okay, let's keep moving. Let's keep moving. So again, you turn the part section of your hair, like so, get that section going, wrap it away, clip it away, whatever you got. I don't got the tools to clip it away, so I'm just gonna wrap it. Take some of your delicious hair mask that you can make. It's kind of edible, except for eggs, unless you went to that kind of thing and run that through your hair. Now the great thing about this mask is that it is all items that you can buy from the grocery store. This is a natural hair mask. There's no harsh chemicals in it. And the best part about it is that you made it yourself. You know exactly what is in this and you have more control. Okay, so I'm actually gonna fast forward this particular section and I'll come back to you when I'm on my next section, okay? But I'm just gonna show you one more time. First thing I like to do is to really pay attention to my edges. So I start as if you would start a perm and I just rub it over my edges because these guys get the most, you know, they go through a lot to be honest. Like they get brushed the most, they get pulled back the most. You know, like they're holding on to a lot and I wanna make sure that they're there. And the wonderful thing about this mask is that it has all the protein. It has protein, potassium, natural oils. It's moisturizing and it definitely promotes hair growth. Like this was a secret to me growing my hair. This mask right here is really how I grew my hair out. And my hair has never been this long in my life. This is definitely the longest my hair has ever been. And it's honestly just been me paying more attention to it, listening to what it needs and giving it exactly what it is. At some point, I literally had no idea I even had a curl pattern. When I used to get perms, I thought, well, my, I was like, ooh, I need a touch up. Cause my roots would come in, I said, ooh, uh-uh, I need a touch up. That's what I used to say. I need a touch up when my roots would come in. And that was my hair growing and talking to me and showing me like her true self and her beauty what's available to me that I have these beautiful curls and I have these luscious locks and they're just gonna continue to grow. And if you use this hair mask, you will definitely see results instantly. Like, do you see this? I can literally just run my fingers through my hair. Everything is just being coated and moisturized and I just absolutely love that guy. So very happy, very happy, very happy. So I'm interested to learn more about hair. So a lot of my videos are either wig, wig reviews and I, I have a lot of wig reviews. I have a lot of fashion videos, a lot of vlogs, travel vlogs, business. Um, I'm, a, I'm a global brand strategist. And so that's my, like, that's my full time gig. And I love coming on YouTube and helping people and teaching people and you know, just learning. So if you haven't subscribed yet, you might wanna go ahead and you know, press that subscribe button so you don't miss out when I'm posting dope content. Yeah, come back to me. Oh, I'm so happy. See, this is what I miss. And watch, when my hair dries, it turns into this big, beautiful afro head and continue this side off camera. So I am fresh out the shower from washing my hair and deep conditioning. And one thing I do need to let you know is that when you, this is no, so important, when you rinse your hair for the first time, I recommend rinsing it in a sink prior to getting, prior to getting into a shower because you need to rinse it with cold water. 
cold water with the egg and the different products that is in it. You don't wanna cook those products in your hair. You wanna make sure that everything is rinsed out before you go ahead to um, shampooing and everything like that. So that's just a pro tip for you just to save you some time and some cooked egg in your hair. All right guys, but I'm absolutely loving the results. I have no product in my hair whatsoever. It's freshly washed. And as you can see, my curls came back. My hair is full. I have bounce, I have body, and I'm just so excited to style it and just be on my way. So go ahead and comment down below. Let me know if you have any questions. Be sure to subscribe to my YouTube channel and check out all of my amazing videos. And if you recently joined the tribe from this video, welcome, you are officially a Bluey. I love you. My name is Gina Blue. Always remember to be blessed beautiful most importantly be you always be yourself and i will see you in the next video Mwah. bye bye ciao zai chin peace out i need to go like do my hair now <laughs>